Right oh, no. G'day everyone out there. Um, just wanted to uh, probably have a little bit of a, a discussion and, and give you a little bit of information about prep next year and our preps this year. There were some really disturbing media reports yesterday that really got my blood boiling a little bit and sort of were just a really off the mark and have really people have no idea what we do in schools and what we particularly do at Rosebud Primary School. Now I've got Beck here with me. So we'll talk a little bit about next year's preps, Beck. So we cater for all levels of learning, don't we? Yes, so we have six targeted learning groups in prep. So that's including five of our prep teachers and we have Linda, our education support staff. Yeah, and Linda's been trained as an expert in English and maths and she catches the kids up. Um, so we actually have four prep grades but six targeted learning groups in maths and English and it's really hard to get this concept across to people that we really don't worry about what grade kids are in anymore. No, and they're fluid moving as well, they're smaller groups and it's hands on learning. Yeah, so we've got some fantastic stories about that too, Beck. So, one little boy. One little boy um, who started off in my group, needed a bit of a boost and was in there for a few weeks and then had a boost and then moved up to the, a new target learning group and then, yeah, it goes yeah, from there. It goes from there and we're trying not to use bottom group and top group or remedial group or pre-prep. We don't label the kids, they actually go to the teacher who best suits their learning needs. And by not labelling them, and there's no stigma about what group they're in, they build their confidence in that group and the building blocks that they need to get to the next level are achieved early. So we have little prep children who are actually in, dare I say it, the top grade one group in maths. You know, already they've achieved that, so they actually go off to grade one lessons and I'd love not to call them grades too. And we try and expand the kids not just up with their level of how high they are, but outwards as well, to make sure that they've got all those foundations and those building blocks so then they can use those skills um, in future years. Righto, so to sum up, education's no longer this comparative, competitive environment anymore. What we try to do at Rosebud Beck is create this collaborative environment where kids help one another and teachers help kids and kids learn from teachers and teachers learn from kids. Absolutely. Yeah, so what we want to try and do is stop this comparison between where a child's at or what they're at. What we're trying to do is develop the whole child so that that child has the confidence to be able to create and to be able to really learn and to want to learn. So I can assure you parents that we're going to do everything to teach the child where they're at and to build them up so that they can get to the next level and making sure that we really worry about the child's well-being in all of this because that's at the heart of every successful individual in education and in life. So that happiness and that ability to want to learn is what we are really focusing on at Rosebud Primary School. So be happy and send your kids along. And the prep kids this year, believe me, they were, they will blitz when in the future.